and welcome to the exciting competitive world of Strike! My name is Footbot. I'm an assistant and instructor with the Galactic Strikers Federation, or GSF for short. If I'm not mistaken, you're a brand new striker, aren't you? In that case, I suggest we kick things off with a little training. Let's go! For everybody else, do the training if you haven't played the game yet. And if you're a little iffy after the first kick, do the training. I'm skipping it just because I did it enough. I don't need it. If you actually get points by doing it, I will go back and do it myself later. As of right now, I don't think it does. So I'm not going to uh, worry about that. And I'm not going online yet. I'm going to start single player cup battles by myself. And we're going to go through all the cups. That's what we're going to start doing for the uh, immediate launch stream that we're doing. Live on YouTube and Twitch. Follow on both if you're not. In cup battles, you'll enter a tournament and try to outwit and outplay teams of CPU opponents on your way to victory. Each win will earn you coins and you can spend on gear for your characters and other things. That's the main reason we're doing the cups, to unlock all that gear. The tournament is double elimination, which means that even if you lose a match, you'll still have another chance. But don't lose twice or you'll be eliminated. There's more about cup battles in the game, guys, so be sure. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, it's time. Let's start. I'm going to enjoy this. Let's go. And personally, I'm an auto player. For those of you that aren't uh, familiar with what this means, um, whenever you have manual, that means you're controlling specifically one character and you have to manually switch between the CPUs if you pass to them or try to set up a shot or something like that. There's some things that are automatic if you're trying to set up a combo but if you pass it to a CPU, they're going to full on take the ball. And they're not going to do anything unless you try to make them pass back to you, etc, etc. I like automatic because I just want to be controlling whoever has the ball. Not going to be the same for whenever we start playing online with other people. Because each individual person is going to have control whenever they have the ball. Period. Unless you're not playing with a full team of four. In which case, somebody's going to be controlling the CPU. So anyway. Uh... For now, let's try to keep it nice and simple. I'm gonna do the bros with no gear. And then I'm gonna do the princess slash queen. Is Rosalina considered a princess? I feel like she should be queen of the cosmos. I think that's right. Anyway, let's uh, pick our color. I don't know, I just like pink the best for these uh let's pick yeah the royal castle why not so no why not yet we're gonna work our way up we're gonna go through all the characters like next time i could do like all bad guys bowser i guess we can count dk wario and waluigi let's do that So I did every single first kick. And aside from a couple hiccups where it was lagging because of the other people that we were playing with, I loved it. It was amazing. If for anyone wondering how I'm playing this quote unquote so early, because I'm playing this long before it launches in America or anything. Simply put, I have a different region account for Japan, Australia, Europe so on and so forth so I just went ahead and got eShop points for Australia and Australia is way ahead of America it's past midnight in Australia so here we are all right so let's see if we can get a quick score on these guys I'm trying to get a feel for the CPUs I'm so used to playing against real people that are gonna wow that was way easier than i thought okay um <laughs> i'm so used to actual people switching between the cpus and charging directly at me so this is gonna take me a little getting used to against cpus and then i'm gonna have to get used to playing against real people again and let's see do you have to buy the game on both accounts no you do not and by the way for uh, anyone watching this on youtube after i upload as a separate video i'm again live streaming on what I 
I am streaming on YouTube and Twitch, so if I randomly read a question and respond to it, that's what I'm doing. What the hell, man? Look how late I kicked him in the face. What the hell, man? <laughs> All right, let's try this again. You know what? Let me let, let me see some. Let me. Oh no! Right into no. I, I, I figured. Out, why, why don't I try to shoot from midfield and randomly make it? You did not. No, sir. I'm taking just the dumbest shots possible just to see if I can make them. I'm not doing anything smart by any means. Oh God. I made it. I assumed I was going to miss it. I was going for the like orb, whatever you call it. So you could do the hyper strike and I accidentally made it. He was so far up. By the way, I've actually played soccer and yeah, that is a very common thing to do IRL like in the not major leagues. <laughs> no, sir. Not again. Stop it. Get some help. By the way, the goalie is basically unbeatable. So if you try to tackle the goalie, he will light you up. He don't play. Oh, no. No one's going to charge at me, huh? <laughs> oh, dang. I love dodging them and getting that speed boost. Oh no. Perfect. Oh no. I did it way too early. Again, I'm used to playing against humans. Dang. Okay. Excuse you. Wow, Luigi blocked the block. I figured I'd go for another random lazy shot. Give me the ball. Give me the ball. Nice. Right off the, <laughs> the post. But anyway, like I was saying earlier, no, you don't need to have the game on both accounts. As long as your switch is the main switch for those accounts. So, for example, the Japanese and Australian accounts are both made for this specific console. So I can use it on any user on the console. Another example is like if you have the family plan or you have the same account on multiple uh, accounts, like uh, my friend Don, Nintendo Don, I'm on his family plan for online and he also let me log in on his account. So I have access to uh, Nintendo Don's entire library of games unless he's online. If he's online, he overrides me. But if he's offline, I can play whatever the heck I want on his account on my system. And it doesn't overlap saves or anything like that. So the Switch is kind of dope like that. Luigi, stop casually walking up and shooting. It can't keep working. Your one time was a fluke. Get over it, my guy. Give me the ball. Uh. I love this game, bro. I love this game. And since I'm only playing against CPUs, I like being able to see the replays and look at all the different camera angles. Like this is the kind of stuff, if I can get enough people to have like an actual tournament, this is something I would love to do. Like get a bunch of friends to record their gameplay don't skip any of these uh, replays and cutscenes. Dang it. I was trying to do a combo pass. This is going to be my first combo pass. <gasps> Gimme. I can do the hyper strike now. All right, uh, chat. Who, who do you want to see the hyper strike for first? You have a time limit. First name I see is what I'm going to do it. Peach. All right, let's go. I just ran out of time! <laughs> oh, damn it! <laughs> oh, that sucks. Oh, yeah. 
I just barely ran out of time. So if I get it again, first one we're gonna do is uh, Peach. I heard we can't 4v4 with friends online. Is that true? No. If it is, then I'm gonna be very upset. Um. Oh my God, what did that have on it? Oh, he's got a star. I can't tackle. Gimme, 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 gimme. I'm sorry, what? Why did it? I didn't know it can move. All right, Peach, here we go. Perfect shot, can't be blocked. They're gonna feel the love. So yeah, if you make it within those blue bars on both the forward and back, it cannot be blocked. See, a perfect hyper strike gets unsight, uh, unstoppable. That's for every single character, kind of hard to do. See, oh yeah, yeah, Max is too locally. Like you can play online with friends and like have full lobbies. Dang it, I was trying to go for one more. Yeah, for the uh for the first kick, we were only able to do two at a time. But online you can do more. Like with the full game. The magicians score an overwhelming victory. Bruh, Luigi tied the game up in one second of possession and I was nervous I guess the rest of the game goes to show that that was a fluke so I scored half my shots they scored one they used seven items I used none I bullied them they only passed one ball dude it's like Luigi kept getting the ball and shooting every time that's crazy. Well, they're down to the losers bracket against the Flyers. And we're off against the Bolts. I'm going to try to go for flawless runs. All right, come on, let's go. Mario next if I get a hyper strike. <gasps> what? No, 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 sir. All right. We, uh. Oh, he, he came very slow with that. Mine. Dang it. Too hard. Too hard. I'm going to catch you sleeping. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm going to catch you sleeping. Mine. <laughs> right in his face. Peach scores in no time flat. Yeah, 28 seconds. That's that's no time. I think that's the notice you'll get if you score in less than 30 seconds. This man jumped forward and to the left. Poor guy. Poor Boom Boom. Stolen. Let's go. All right, so sh there's different ways you can guide the ball. Like I said, I skipped training because I already did it. Oh, I was going to try to steal that. Oh, I actually got it. Well, Peach got it. Okay. And shoot. So you can aim forward or back. Forward drives the ball straight more easily and oh i didn't mean to skip but it's fine and holding back will lob it up so lobbing it up makes it go over his head if he's too far up and pushing it harder makes it to where he has to jump way further to get the ball and of course you can aim left and right to go well technically up and down to go to the left or right of the net so all right oh jesus 
I need to score fast. I need to score fast. See, so is there custom matches? Yes, for online. Maybe locally, I'm not sure. Maybe if you just do quick play, but I haven't messed with quick play yet. I went straight into the cups. And again, for wondering, uh, I'm sorry, for people wondering how I had the game early, Australian e shot. All right, Mario, let's go. Oh, shoot, I might not make it. I might not make it. I was a little late. I was a little slow. So now, Boom Boom has a chance to block. And if he does, it'll probably... Oh, wow, he didn't. Cool. Um, if he did block it, the ball might just stop right in front of him. Like, he won't catch it. It'll just bounce in front of him. He'll be stunned for just a moment, which is why I was running in front with Luigi. If he had blocked it, I would have just let Luigi take it and tap it right in with the goalie being completely out of commission. Stop scoring immediately! I will drop you! That's every goal! All the CPUs are just walking up the middle and shooting wide and Boom Boom's just like, and completely missing. <laughs> I thought it'd be funny if I did it. Rosalina, no. Bruh, he completely missed, but because, oh, whoops. <gasps> Excuse you, Mario. Dash at me, I dare you. Oh, well, he did. Gimme, 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 gimme. Well, oh, actually, I had a knife. It's fine. It's fine. Mario, take it. Don't you dare. You know what? <laughs> Luigi time. Got it. I'm abusing this man with hyper strikes. I love it. I love it. It's so dumb. But I love it. See, if you have time to get a perfect hyper strike, that means you were just given all the time in the world, no pressure. So when you're playing online, fight for that orb. Even if you don't have the ball, fight for it just so your opponent can't have it. Unless it puts you so far out of the way, it's an easy goal for them. I'm trying to go for 10. During the first kick, my max score was 7 to 0. Just now, I got 8 to 1 against the first batch of CPUs, but... If I can get a perfect shutout, 10 plus to 0, I'll be happy. That's the goal for this cup. 10 to 0, or more. But a shutout nonetheless. So if they can stop scoring on me the moment they get the ball from me. Ow. No. Oh, see, they have it, so I can't have it. So now I'm trying to just play keep away. Nope. <gasps> no! No. Uh -oh. No. See, I just made him nervous. Get away from me. Whoa, not the banana! That almost sucked. Dang it. No, 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 no. Yeah, no! No! No, stop. All of you. Cease. Discontinue. Dang it. Yeah, doing a perfect dodge like I just did, charges up the ball, makes it kick way faster. So, 
That's why I'm always waiting on that. Ah! No shot. Bro, if Boom Boom had slapped it into his own goal, I would have been hooping and hollering. We would have been on this screen for the next three minutes. Let's see, do you have to aim your dodges or can you just hit the button and dodge? You have to aim. So, whether you're trying to tackle or dodge, you have to aim the direction you're trying to do so. So if you dodge into them, you're gonna get kicked in the face and they're gonna steal the ball from you. If you dodge away from them, you leave them in the dirt, they're rendered useless for the next like three seconds. Meanwhile, you got a speed boost and you're yeeting yourself across the field. So yeah, the game's very technical. It doesn't take too long to get moderately good at the game. You just have to do training mode. It's gonna go through every single function, beginner, intermediate, and advanced, every single tactic. There's nothing you have to learn or teach yourself how to manipulate on your own. The training mode covers absolutely everything. And then the only way you finish the training is if you perform the moves they told you to perform. So you can't not know how to do it, but you have to do the training. Take it slow, repeat it if you have to. If anything's like, whoa, that did not stick with me. What do I have to do? Just do it again. Give yourself a solid hour in training and you'll have all the core mechanics down and then it's just a matter of getting good based on who you play against. Did you know you could dodge with the right stick? I will try that. I did not know you could do that. Or that or I forgot. Because it probably said R or the stick. And I was just like, yeah, R is more comfortable. But we'll see. We'll, we'll see what happens. Oh, well, I'm sorry. No, not again. You can dodge with the stick. That's beautiful. I'm sorry. I know this is the finals, but no. Ah! I had to take a long, uncharged shot. Come here. Oh, Mario just walked up and took it. <laughs> that was beautiful. I love Mario, bro. No pun intended. <laughs> anyway, let's go. Yeah, I can't wait to play as Waluigi. Or Bowser. The next cup is going to be fun. Like, playing as the villains, very fun. Also, you cannot pick up item blocks for the other team. The way that they get those items is if you tackle somebody who doesn't even have the ball. Sometimes it's useful. Sometimes you don't want to risk it because you don't want to give them a good item. It's a play-by-play -play thing. You have to decide what's best for you in the moment. All about strategy. I hate you. I hate you. I hate you. No. <gasps> Get it? I just barely made that. Okay, so they're really going for items. I kicked it right into him. Jeez. If he wasn't so far into the net, that probably would have worked. I'm sorry. Oh, no. All right, Yoshi's down. I'm sorry, no. Give me the ball. Kick at me. Kick at me. Sucker. Dang it. No, 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 no. Gimme. Taking that shot now. Don't care. I'm winning the game. Around the world. Freeze him. Oh yeah, by the way, she freezes everyone in her path. Unfortunately, no one was really in the path except boom boom. So he kind of fell over, but that was it 
I love this game. I hope it lasts. Like, I really hope it doesn't pull a Mario Tennis uh, Ultra Smash. Because that was bad. <laughs> like, literally, the game itself was met. I hate you. I wanted my shutout. Not a fan. Not a fan. So I tackled the wrong guy. I mean, I tackled who I wanted to, but didn't really do me much good. Ow. No. Easy shot from downtown. Ye. <laughs> that look of damn. We out here dying. <laughs> nice. Yeah, one of the hardest things to do in this game as a whole is combo passing and combo shooting. Just because getting that opening and getting the timing down. It's like if I had charged that up, I may have, I might have made it. But even if I did, I'm pretty sure it would have gotten blocked. At worst, it would have stunned him. I'm sorry, at best, it would have stunned him, rather. All right, who's less? Actually, I did. I did it with everybody. Oh, God. No! No! Wow, right when she lost it. Nope. I was hoping that would put up enough of a shield. I put it in a bet. Bad spot. See, that is why charging is usually good. If he doesn't catch it, it stuns him for just a moment so he can get a rebound shot. There's actual physics in this game. It's almost like it's regular soccer, but with superpower characters who aren't flagged for touching the ball with their hands. Are you stunned? Uh, see, like, if anybody else was ready for it, it would have been fine. And that's something that we're going to have to really be on uh, communications for when the full game comes out. I'm sorry, not when the full game comes out. When, um, when full teams become a thing. Like, when you get with your friends and you're playing a full 4v4, you're going to have to communicate because each individual person's controlling a single character. And... Yeah. Oh, yeah. You gotta be ready. I wanna see competitive teams of this. I wanna see pro Mario Strikers players. What's that gonna be like? Stop scoring on me immediately! <laughs> Let's see, it feels like he gets stunned so much cr quicker than Critter. Bring my Scaly Boy back. I will admit, I miss Critter. Boom Boom is fitting, but I wish Critter was still in this. He's literally Critter, but for this game. Like, he, it, there's no difference between the two. There's really not. They're exactly the same. But, just aesthetic wise, I, I miss him because he was like, part of the series and now he's not all right as long as he can't have it magicians have done it they're taking home the trophy yet even if i lost i would have played against them again because they already had one loss that's the beauty of double elimination Man, when he just barely misses the slap, fills me with such joy when it's me. But when it's against me, like, bro, my man didn't even know he got scored on. He's just like, what? Huh? 
See, that was one of the more disappointing ones. That was just a bad play on me, period. I should have gotten greedy trying to knock them all out. I should have just gone for the ball, but it's fine. I took way less shots than him. To be fair, two of mine were worth two points, I think, if I'm not discounting that. Yeah, I'm a bully. I tackle a lot. I pass to somebody who's open so I can take a charge shot more. The one thing I really need to work on is combo passes and combo shots. If I can master that, oh, challenge me, please. And through the portal comes the trophy. And 400 coins.